And now, the conclusion. Whoa! Dude! Welcome home. You know what? Okay, what do you represent? Are you my guilt? That's just fantastic. I had fifty. Fifteen health kits! You telling me I lost fifteen health kits? At least tell me that my HP is full. I lost fifteen health kits. And I don't even have full HP. Duh is right, Murphy. Let's grab a chair to make people sit down, sir. Is that paper for me? 7 p.m. Showers. Be ready. Sewell. Sewell! They don't even have a flashlight. I wonder if this is actually the other world. I mean, the other world in Silent Hill games doesn't have to be all satanic. It can just be a darker version of the normal world, like in uh, Silent Hill 1, Silent Hill 2. Silent Hill 2 is really subtle. Might be a little crossover on this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They made it so obvious with the cutscene. Yeah, good thing you pulled the chair out of your po pocket again. Whoa! This is serious. Serious black. Now where? Whoa, whoa. Come on, Murphy, hold it together, man. Hold it together, man. That's what Satan wants. Fucking Satan! He's never going to leave me- No, I lost Satan! My favorite weapon of all time! And I thought I would be taking him with me to the final battle. I thought I saw you in a grocery store The hair was frizzy and the eyes were yours but you turned and walked away You turned and walked away Fudge me Fudge me right in the face Oh gee thanks, this will make up for the 15 I lost Oh boy. Oh boy, this ain't good. So I was whoring. Okay, this needs a key. I need another key card. Another? I don't even have a w one. So I was stashing and hoarding all those weapons and all that am come in handy. ammo and, and the damn thing open. for nothing? Needs an item. Okay, 
Blah is a male years old. He is serving a Blah year sentence for Blah and Blah. He appears to be in excellent physical health. We briefly discussed his past as well as the events that led to his incarceration. Blah maintains a soft-spoken and somewhat introverted demeanor, yet appears to be co cognizant of his crimes and able to serve his sentence without causing any trouble or displaying resistance. For these reasons, I recommend he be approved for placement in general population. Respectfully submitted by Wayne Blah. They're talking about me? This, this, I, I have no clue. Is that a doll head? Hey, doll. What is that? Oh, it's a dead person. Oh, no, no, no matter. It's okay. You don't need these anymore, do you? Derp, derp, derp. Well, I have his access card now. Okay, this is now starting to feel like a real horror game. Insert code. Well, I don't have a code, you duty head. I'm assuming this is not the access card for this. Nope. Oh, it's electricity. Huzzah! I am out! I escaped! It's, it's a jailbreak! I am so screwed right now, aren't I? My only regret is that I used... If, that I would have used my uh, health kit. Let's go into the cloakroom. I assume that I need to make myself down to the showers for some sort of messed up confrontation. Wait, where's my shotgun? Oh, I forgot I couldn't pick it up yet. Well, I have my walkie-talkie again. So I can walkie while I talkie! I am five. Huh. What's this? I thought it was an item. Okay, where are the Satans? This leads to wing B. Let's let's stay in our current wing for now before we head there. Is there anything in the duty bucket? No, just duty. Well, that's boring. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Fuck, that startled me. You've got to be shitting me. Come on, Murphy. Ah. All roads lead to wing B, not to Rome. Where is James to put his hand down there into that uh, bowl? I wouldn't do it. Here we go. Babe, well, another day, another letter from this hellhole. It's been eight months now since I got locked up, and it seems like things only get worse. I know some rough guys on the outside, but none of them come close to the freaks in here. I'm talking stone-cold fucking killers, rapists, even sick-ass child molesters, and the worst of all are the gods. I swear, there ain't a straight fucking one in the bunch. Just assholes with badges who get their rocks off knocking around the inmates. I always thought getting ass raped by some dude was gonna be what I had to worry about in here. No one said... Uh, nothing about having to watch my back for dumbass crooked b bulls all the time. Okay. I can't wait to get out of here and back to you. Just four more months. Oh, Ricky. Ricky, you see, is, is no stranger to love. I'm sorry. I traumatized people with that last message, I know. Okay, I guess we can go to the West Blanc, or Blanc B, or whatever the frack you want to call it. Thankfully, this is locked, so I won't have to go up there just yet. What? 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 Going down? 
Well, that's life for you. It's full of ups and downs. <laughs> Oh, hey. Dude. Ow. Dude! Not cool! Not cool at all. Okay. Jeez, they, they sent me back from the very beginning, which kinda sucks. That is not fair! Haha! <laughs> ow, ow! This dude does so much damage! Da! Jeez Louise, these guys are tough! I need to get some better equipment and fast! I'm a Satan already! It's a crowbar. Gonna hold on to my axe for just a little bit longer. <whistles> Didn't see anything. Okay. Um. Uh, why is this ball a reoccurring theme? I wasn't done exploring! Well, if you were in doubt that we were in the other world, now we are in the other world, 100%. And I don't have any health. Isn't that just fantastic? What? You're fine. Hey Murphy, other Murphy, do you have some health for me? Murphy. Something scary is going to happen. Okay, Murphy, forgiveness? You have the balls to ask me for forgiveness? How can I possibly forgive you when you've destroyed everything I had left in this world? Every time I look at you, all I can see is his face. I only ever asked one thing of you, and that was to be a good father to our son. You failed me, Murphy. You failed me, and you failed Charlie. And now there's no way we'll ever have him back. Don't call me, don't write me, I never want to see you again. Carol. Holy fuck. Carol rhymes with Cheryl. It's all connected. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? That was really cool, actually. I wasn't done exploring anyway. What are you? I have no strings. You know I'm gonna die if I keep fighting you, right? 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 Dude! Not cool! <laughs> I mean... I wasn't worried. Thank God they reset me from here. Last time they reset me from the beginning, that was incredibly annoying. Peace! I'm a pacifist! Gandhi is my idol! Goodbye, sucker. I was just about to teach him a lesson. He's not chasing me, right? No. Oh, we weren't worried. Let him dare show his face. Somewhere else. You seem to forget we exist. I am not gonna be. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Noob! Sucker! Nobody loves you! The way up is unlocked. Why well, can't you chase me through here? Got me at my big mouth! No! <laughs> Better you than me! Okay. Is this the electricity thing? Oh, thank God. Because there's something shiny in there and I want it. But before we do that, let's explore! Dough. Nothing to explore! Well, at least that dude is dead now. I'm sure we won't be seeing him again, huh? -huh. It was a chair? All this time I thought it was like something, like a quest item, and it turned out to be a chair? <sighs> Can I turn it back on? T to make sure that nobody's chasing me? Hey, the control room! Sweet! What is that? A quarter! Nylon? You like nylon? I'm not gonna stop you. Nylon! Or maybe he meant Cylon. <laughs> Can I use a quarter? <laughs> <You know? laughs> what about this? Nope. Can't access weapons just yet. Oh, thank God for health at least. BBD seeking public assistance in locating individuals suspected of child murder. The Boston Police Department has issued a Beyond the Lookout or BOLO alert for blah blah, probably Napier, in connection with the murder of an eight year old male. In the BOLO alert, BPD expresses interest in locating and questioning the subject. Armed and dangerous. Well, we killed him like a boss, so. And I still can't access these things, so. Sad face. I think a shotgun would help with facing that monster. Okay. Is there anything I can really do in here? Finally! Oh my god! Mein Gott, was ist das? Oh. Nobody. And I mean, nobody! 
What? Stop it with the cheap jump scares. It's lame. Here, have a quarter. No? That worked. Not. Uh, Overlook pen Penny Ten... Penitentiary, sorry, the prison of no return. Well, that sounds great. By Paul Grimm. In operation for more than 50 years, Overlook Penitentiary has garnered a reputation as a place where prisoners are sent to never be seen or heard from again. But that's not all. Overlook has also been rumored for decades to be haunted! Strange disembodied voices, ghost-like apparitions, gruesome deaths and unexplained disappearances. The inventory of peculiar happenings that have been reported over the years to both prison staff and inmates is disturbingly prolific, some might say. Others, however, claim that it is nothing more than legends. No questions about it, Warden Stephen Crevision told us. This can be an extremely scary place. We've got society's worst of the worst locked up here. Many of them clinically insane. It's just a matter of time until crazy stories flow out, regardless of how impossibly horrifying it may sound. Despite his doubts about the paranormal aspects of Overlook, Crevision does admit that some portions of the prison's notorious reputation are not wholly undeserved. Over the years, there have been numerous reports of strange deaths within Overlook's foreboding walls, and even more bizarre disappearances. And although a number of these incidents remain unsolved, Crevision maintains that the vast majority are easily explained. <laughs> yeah, right. <sighs> this prison haunted? But it's so normal! What? You gotta be kidding, it can't be haunted, no! No, there's no Satan here! Come on! <laughs>